now that I finished configuring the second tag I'm going to configure the next tag which is PyML flow 12 in here I can again check on the different options that I have under the tag name PyML flow 12 I will have no comment tag no different schedule the same schedule as the tour no preformat no conditional specification but I would like to enter some data validation numbers the options here include lower and upper limits for a low low limit and I want to have a 5% low limit of 10 90 for the high limit and 95 for the high high in addition to being able to set up these limits I also have an option of specifying actions when these limits are violated some of the options that are available include requiring a signature when the limit is violated or requiring a comment or prompting a specific message in this case I'm going to specify for the low low limit a message call the control room so when I enter data if the value is below 5 I will receive a message that says call the control room for my low limit I'm going to specify another action which is a required signature and now I will be done with that tag the last tab are the options for an entire tag group so let's go ahead and talk about how to create tag groups if I have five different tags that can be grouped together in a logical manner maybe they are within the same unit or they are similar pieces of equipment I can group those together in a tag group and select the options that will apply for the entire group in order to create a group I click on the tag group editor icon and here I will be able to create new groups let's say that we have a group that belongs to unit 2 and I want to group those tags together now I can see that I have a new group under which I can group tags together I can click OK and that group will be shown in the lower right pane and I can select now the tags that belong to that group and all I have to do is drag those tags into the group so I will include PyML floats 15 through 20 into my new group now instead of having to select options for each one of these tags individually I can select the group and select the options for that group going back to the first pane I can see that now my options for the individual tags are shaded because I can now select those options for the entire group in the tag group configuration which includes the barcode which will allow me to navigate to that group during data collection a comment tag and I'm going to select string number one for a comment tag where my observations will be stored when I'm collecting data for this entire group I can have a different collection schedule for this entire group that can be different than the collection schedule for the tour and I can, I can also have a conditional specification for this entire group and the conditional specification that I'm going to set is that if the current value of my first tag which is PyML float <coughs> 1 is 
greater than 90 then I will collect the data otherwise I will skip the collection now I am done selecting the options for each one of my individual tags I can save the changes for the entire tour and exit this menu